What's up? Good morning, everybody. Good, good morning. Uh, today I'm sitting at the bus stop with my go pen because my dad bought me the go pen yesterday. Sitting here, chilling here today, uh, waiting for today's bus. It should be getting here um, in about 10 minutes. So just kind of hanging out until then. Uh, there's the other one. But uh, yeah. I had to wake up in a rush and then come and sit on this here bench because I thought that I was going to miss the bus, but I guess it's good that I came and didn't sleep in anymore. But anyways, yeah, I'm on my way to work right now and I'll see you guys when I get there. Rah! So that sucks. I just put gas in my scooter, but I don't. I haven't put oil in it yet, like a retard. So it's bogging down. It's going like really, really slow. But I got to get some two-stroke oil for it, and then after that, it should run like, like, uh, like, like, like good. You know? Oh shit. <laughs> So you guys probably remember the other day when I was talking about my e-cig blowing up. Yeah, well, that's up. What I did was I took my girlfriend's, my girlfriend's old battery back door from her Segeli 100 watt and Cooper's old Segeli and put them together. So I have a mod now. Yay. Um, besides that, I've got a question for you guys. I don't know. Um, I'm really not sure if you guys know anything about this kind of stuff, but I am just wondering. This gas scooter that I got, how the fuck do you tune a carburetor? <laughs> um, it was really, really low on gas when I bought it, and now that I have it, um, I tried to put a little bit more gas in it, but I didn't put oil in it, so it started to bog down. And I don't want to ride it, because I don't want to blow the motor. So someone comment and tell me, uh, what, I mean, I, I know the ratio, but I don't know how to measure the ratio out. 25 to 1 or 40 to 1 gas oil mixture ratio, two-stroke oil. I don't know how to do all that. I don't have, like, the correct things. I would just, like, when I was a kid, I would just pour the freaking oil into the gas until it looked all, you know, blue and murky and stuff. So I, I don't really know what to do. But, yeah, um, here's a little view of the scooter itself. It's only a 25 or 23.5 or 25 cc motor. The deck's all shot out, but it still works. Um, there's a little priming bubble under there. I don't know if you guys can see that. There's the scooter itself. It folds up and you can ride it. It's the kind where it has a spindle. I don't think I can even get a view of it, but it's got a spindle that goes on the back wheel. And basically, when the motor's turned on, that spins and it turns the wheel. You have to literally walk and jump on it and go or there is a pull start but you have to put your foot underneath the deck and kind of prop it up and then start it but it's pretty cool it doesn't go really fast at all but it gets me to where I need to go um, you got basically rock hard solid rubber wheels with plastic cores um, it's only got a front and brake as you can see 
but I'm really trying to uh, kind of get used to it and tune it up so it runs a lot better. But yeah, there's a the scooter, guys. But yeah, there's a the scooter for you guys. Any of you uh, scooter enthusiasts, comment below or share a link with me uh, or maybe some how-to YouTube videos. Kind of show me what different things I can do, what I need to know, anything I can learn, um, and also how to kind of upgrade it and little parts that are inexpensive to get that I can use to make it go faster. Because right now it probably only hits about 20 miles an hour. Um, I have to tune it right now after I put the gas and oil back into it um, to make sure that it's running correctly. Because like I said, after I put the gas in, it started to bog down and stuff. So somebody comment. I don't know who will, but somebody will comment. And let me know kind of what to do or give me a link. Maybe you own a scooter shop and you want to give me some information. Um, but yeah, anyways, that's kind of it for the scooter. But um, I've got to say, go Greek yogurt. It's really, really, really good coffee. Do you like it or no? I mean, I'm eating, the I'm, I'm eating the yogurt. So you have, do you like the coffee though? Sometimes. Sometimes? Yeah, they have really, really, really good coffee. Y'all should come try some. Stuff's amazing. Probably gonna get some coffee ads now. So, we had some people working with us last night. Well, not me, but. Um, they uh, basically almost broke these machines. They left them on auto all night when they should be on standby. With nothing in them, yeah, with nothing in the machines at all. Stupid. As fuck. Come on down to Go Greek Newport Beach. We have a passion for flavor and a dedication to health. So I've got a question for you guys. Do you guys like when I do stuff like this? Let me know in the comments because I don't know if I want to keep doing it. I'm not gonna know if you don't tell me. So you should let me. All it is is basically just a certain time of editing and filming when you put it together, and it's cool. It does take some extra work, but I just want to know if you guys like it the way I do. I don't know. If not, then I'll stop doing it. All right, guys. So I'm about to start work. So I'll go ahead and see you on the inside. Heck yeah, guys. Today is a very exciting day for me. Uh, my buddy Aaron that works at Kroberger, shout out to Kroberger on the peninsula between uh, Pavilions and right next to Go Greek and uh, Chipotle. Um, he just hooked it up with a Relo. Um, it's a very, very nice high quality mod, fits perfectly in the hands, a little bit weight, but this thing definitely um, has good battery life. If you look at the back of it, it's got three batteries. So the battery life on this thing is insane. I do believe that this can take all different kinds of wire. I just threw my crown tank on it. I literally just gave him the Segeli and trade for this. So I'm really stoked. Shout out to Aaron at Crowburger and you guys, all of you guys who go eat there should give him fat tips. Thank you so much. Maybe here, check this out. Oh my god! Yeah. Helping Aaron out. Yeah. Bro, bro needs Siggy Sigs and he can't get them. Yes, he can. Just kidding, that's a lot. No, I don't know. Yeah. Wait. Go ahead. You just told me not to call you immature? Or not to be immature? <laughs> Are you fucking serious? Oh my god, whatever. Says the guy who entered fart noises into the video. Stay with the camera. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you so much um, for another day of support. I really do appreciate it, and so does she, even though she doesn't know it. But thank you so much. Go ahead and give this video a huge thumbs up, like it, and subscribe, and make sure to share it with all your friends. Or don't. Eh. Lisa! <laughs> god, don't listen to her. But yeah, thanks so much. Like and subscribe. You need to. I'll haunt your life. I'm the spawn of Satan. Okay. Thank you so much. Fuck you. Ra. Like and subscribe.